right? A little premature start there. Uh, my name is Kelly. This is Eugene and Laura. We'll be presenting to you Team Yellow's project, The Modual. The Modual is a do-it-yourself wall system that can be customized to fit an urban apartment without damaging existing structures. Uh, it can be, it's customizable to a wide variety of uh, lengths, heights, and decorative finishes, and it takes about one hour to assemble and disassemble a typical installation. I will be talking about the product. Eugene will be taking you through the technical details, and Laura will be telling you about our business assessment. Rent is high. In places like New York and Boston, uh, doubling or tripling up within rooms is common. We are targeting customers that have more roommates than rooms. Based on the 2005 New York State Census, uh, we estimate that approximately 200,000 renters in New York City alone are sharing their room with one or two roommates. <laughs> Module creates personal space. Our main technical challenge was the fit both vertical and horizontal. We needed to create a modular system that would be able to fit most existing spaces. Another one of our challenges was non-damage to existing ceilings, floors, and walls. We also wanted to create a wall that was as sturdy and soundproof as normal drywall walls without compromising aesthetics or ease of installation. We went through a number of different ideas from telescoping sections to flexible materials to interlocking panels to the final design you see before you. Our product has three main parts. Posts with extension caps, panels, and trim. As you can see in this, these slides, the wall is created section by section until the desired length is achieved. The posts with extension caps extend to the desired vertical height, and the panels span between the posts. And now Eugene will be taking you through the technical details. Thank you, Kelly. So first, I'd like to direct your attention to the posts seen here, and here, and here. Our posts are made of a strong, lightweight aluminum extrusion. Our posts are built to fit a wide variety of ceiling heights spanning a full range from 7 feet all the way up to 12 feet. As Katrin is demonstrating here for you, when installing the posts, they can conveniently be aligned using a post level, which is of course included with every module wall kit. <laughs> the main functionality of the post comes from the extension cap found at the bottom of every post. The extension cap allows for individual adjustment of each post height, which allows us to compensate for uneven ceilings, which sometimes happens in you know, cheap New York apartments. <laughs> the extension cap provides 80 pounds of force on the floor and ceiling. In our tests, we found that this correlates into a 300 pound man, such as myself, <laughs> being able to lean against the post without causing any damage to the floor or ceiling. The mechanism by which this works is that the user would tighten the extension cap, thereby lengthening the posts. Once the, post, once the top of the post reaches the ceiling, a compression spring within the, ex, within the extension cap, shown in the, in the diagram up there, begins to compress, providing the necessary force to keep the post in place without falling over. We are able to precisely control the amount of force using a visual indicator, shown here. The little green window starts to appear green when the user has uh, provided enough force for the post to stay up on its own but then turns red to indicate when there's too much force applied, uh, signaling the user to back off. Once the posts are put up in place, the next step is to install our panels, which make up the bulk of the wall. Our panels are sturdy, yet extremely lightweight. The inner layer of our, of our panels consists of a cardboard and foam combination. This combination of materials provided the best sound damping qualities in our tests, yet was still very lightweight and sturdy. The outermost layer of our laminate was a uh, laminate material often found in kitchen countertops. This gave us uh, a great deal of durability and also the look and feel of a real wall. 
while also giving us while also giving the user a wide variety of colors and finishes to choose from, so they can have the wall look exactly the way they want to. In addition, the panels can be cut to size, both in width and in height, to make sure that our wall fits fits each user's apartment perfectly. Uh, once the panels are in place, they are kept in place by a vertical trim piece, which is attached to either side of the post using industrial strength Velcro. This Velcro has an extremely high amount of holding power, yet is relatively easy and intuitive to install and remove as well. And it's not too loud, I hope. <laughs> but it is very quick and easy. Uh, before we could say that the module was a complete product, we had to work out a number of design details. I'd like to direct your attention to the baseboard at the bottom, at the bottom of the wall. This baseboard allows us to compensate for uneven floors, which can also be found in some cheap New York City apartments, <laughs> and also hides a gap between the lowermost panel and the floor. We have a number of doors available in a wide variety of styles, which are all lightweight and easy to install. They're installed in very much the same way as the panels. And finally, we've also designed a corner piece, which, allow, which gives the user greater freedom in designing the final shape of their, their brand new room. Multiple compliant features in our design also give our product a degree of robustness, as we can accommodate errors in measurement of up to an inch and a half. This means that virtually anyone can install and enjoy a brand new module. Now here is Laura with our business case. Thank you. Thanks, Eugene. When assessing the feasibility of bringing our product to market, we considered a single unit to be a typical wall of 12 feet in length. Based on our customer survey data and research of competing products, we determined that we would need to sell the wall for less than $1,000. As you can see here, we did a cost assessment of how much we would need to spend in order to manufacture module walls in large quantities. The starter kit consists of one post and the door, and the additional four posts and three panel sections make up the rest of the 12 feet in length. Based on these numbers, we determined that we can produce one unit at a cost of $310 to us. We would then sell that unit for $950. We know of several companies competing in our uh, target market. There are six companies in New York City which lease temporary walls made out of drywall and require professional installation. These companies typically charge about $1,000 for a wall 12 feet in length. We will be charging $50 less for a wall of the same size with several important improvements. First, our customer will own their product and will be able to keep the product once they are done using it, unlike our competitors who only lease the product for a number of several years at a time. Second, since the module wall does not require professional installation, the user can reuse and reinstall their wall as many times as desired. We estimate that each of these competing companies sells about 500, between 500 and 1,000 units per year. So we are confident that there is a large market that we can break into. We decided to distribute the module wall through online orders. First, this eliminates the cost needed when dealing with through a retailer. And second, we felt that this would really simplify the process of purchasing for our customers, since the only information they would need to provide would be the dimensions of their desired wall. This distribution model has been successful in other markets, such as the custom closet industry. We would develop a website for our product, and users would be able to obtain an instant price quote. By entering their ceiling height, their desired length of wall, and selecting preferences, such as the color of the panels or type of door, our users would then be presented with a final package in detailing all of the parts they would need for their wall. We would then assemble the packages by hand, ensuring that the panels were cut appropriately to the size to correctly fit the user's apartment, and that each package included all of the necessary parts. We will develop a, an extensive marketing campaign directed at New York City retailers and landlords. We developed a five-year plan of costs and expected revenues based on an initial investment of $1.3 million. We anticipate a 5% market penetration in New York City in the first year and anticipate future expansion into other cities as well. Based on this data, we determined that our net present value is about $2 million, our internal rate of return is 77%, and we can break even within three years. 
Ultimately, we believe that we have a solid business plan based on conservative assumptions and a quality product which serves a very real need in the urban real estate market. Finally, we would like to thank these individuals for their help and support throughout the project. And at this point, we would be happy to answer any questions you might have about the module.